Oi, welcome to Atomic Horde. We're right in here. This room is kind of cool. And I'm just gonna follow this door that the Oracle right here opened for me. With me over part loot. Eh, it's not that over part. The Hawk 7 gave me quite a lot of trouble. So, I guess it could be better. Char yeah. <laughs> Perfect time to end this conversation before it even starts. Charles, what do the special neuroconnectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuroconnectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them, but the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh... I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Oh, was this a Lord of the Rings reference? Comrade! Good hey, comrade! Help! Get me out of here! I'm a student from the tour! And my father's, like, really, really important? No. So what am I supposed to do about that? Dude, just help me already! Sheesh! I'm not just some nobody! Do you even know whose son I am? Come on, comrade, don't be a dick! Get me out of here! Whoever your old man is, his son is dead. What? What do you fucking mean, dead? How am I talking to you, then? Are you an idiot? You are the working class, so work, damn you! Do you even know who I am? No, I don't, and I don't care. We're not buddies. Get that through your thick skull, and the working class can punch back, you spineless piece of... Meat? What? Uh, am I really? Shit. And yes, you are. I'll pass it along to your tour guide. Bye, asshole. Stop it, TV. Oh, I can just face through it. Lovely. Higher and higher, legends will never die. This remains true even for agricultural crops. The specimens of purposely bred plants presented here are capable of surviving in any environment, even on the surface of other planets. An impressive exhibit, isn't it? You want to know my opinion about corn? No, thank you. I'd like to hear how you feel about the way man alters nature to make it better serve his needs. Yeah, whatever. Is there something special in here? Well, let's farm this robot then. Oh boy, <laughs> it's a death trap. It's a death trap. Ooh. That's a death trap, all right. It's a death trap, it's a death trap. <laughs> um, no, I don't think I'm supposed to mess with him. I'm probably not supposed to mess with it. Oh god damn it. Oh no, go up again. Ah, uh, I'm gonna try Charles, it though. What do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors Where's do in your fact have the letter button? Beta on them, 
But the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. That was a surprise. Charles, what do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the f fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them, but the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh. I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to the light rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of them. Okay, nope, nope. Oh, I get it. Don't attack this robot. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Mm. Charles, oh. what do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them, but the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called Beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Lovely names. A bunch of lovely names. <clears throat> Oh, I feel bad about not surviving that fight at all. Like, uh, oh, is that a part of her? Yes, that's a lot of... Let's take off the enemies. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey! Eat that robot. We got her body. Ugh. We put that in our pocket. In our pocket. Doors to go through. Way too many. New scanning. 
Reporting cycle. Module, limb, leg, left. Not found. <sighs> Just great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit, these mustached perverts must have dragged her into the maintenance room. I'm on my way. Why? What are they doing with her leg? And the game is completely silent again. You perverts. A lot of loot here. Nice cartridge. So if I do this. Nope, 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 nope. Nah. Um, nope. And do this. And do this. Yes. I got stuff. Okay. No employees here. They do look different from time to time, I feel like. I just mixed through. Meh. Hello. Saving data. This place used to be really nice. Until everybody got killed. It is a most tragic sight. Oh, I feel bad stuff is gonna happen. Seriously? Why can't I take stuff here? It's gonna suck as soon as everybody starts attacking me. Game sort of future, young VIPs. That doesn't look messed up at all. A lot of thumbnail material. <laughs> because I'm sick as all hell. Oh, one of those dudes. We're gonna fight him too. And a naked man in the back. Gotta get the naked man out of my screen. Yeah. <laughs> Weird. Oh god, one of those. Because the game just needs all the puzzles in the world. So I just need to move the red one. Just literally impossible. <gasps> I feel like I already messed up. Just need to move the rare one. No. Oh. It's going to take forever. Forever, I tell ya. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Red and yellow must be next to each other. Good. Oh, okay. I hate this one the second most. I have a bad feeling like I'm gonna cr get crushed by everything here. Ah, oh, damn you. Oh boy. Yeah, this sucks already.
Oh, they're everywhere. They're everywhere already. <clears throat> That's still not dead. There's one. Damn. Oh, I haven't seen those in a while. This room is sick and cool looking though. And very quiet. Not a flute. This one's good. Sorry, thank you. Glitched. Just like that, it's glitched. <laughs> oh, God. oh, no, not today. I was looting everything. Nope. Maybe, maybe. Let's just go back. Additional loot rooms. Alright. Oh no. Hey, this is new. You may need to apply spatial reasoning here. There's no may about it. These locks of yours are really something, you know that? Not a new puzzle. What the hell is this? Oh. Hey, Charlie, oh. why couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks everywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who hacked the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. In other words, pretty much anybody. Why did the music just start and die? Ah. Ah. Sneak shot. Die. God damn it, Johnny Sins is looking at me. So much sex appeal. Whoa! Oh, hey, dude. I'm just getting Get started. Back in here.
almost dodged into that. like that and music is dead oh. <laughs> must be parts <coughs> that's not the way I'm supposed to go right Charles, I've never seen Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his Alpha Connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique, and its shape and location are one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his Alpha Connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching it, Argentum? Entrusting humans with the connector would be far too risky. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the ballerina twins? The way they move, they're so graceful and elegant. They kind of remind me of something. Is that so? Hmm. What exactly, Comrade Major? I don't know. Something... something good. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to, how I'm supposed to do this, right? I just kind of glitched it. Don't try to drop kick me. I'm gonna eat your face. Please taxi. Yeah. German. So I can intimidate him more. The music is dying. Why? Not cool. Definitely forked anyways. Right. 
not a cool fight. I was just not ready. Just not ready, man. The shotgun definitely needs the magazine upgrade. And I can't get it. Game says no. Oh, that's priceless. Right. Right. I would definitely also make puzzles like that. Golden picks. Right. Right. Definitely. <coughs> Definitely. Downstairs. <coughs> right. Okay, sure. Puzzles, love it. No man, just, just, hope, just turn around and jump. Puzzles, I love them. You have Come reached on. the facility service rooms, Major. One of my dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, the truth is out there. Right. I've never seen bots like these before. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Uh, oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. Mm -hmm. uh, there, are two, there are two of them. Get over here. Oh, this is good. Let them just sit in there. They get damage anyways. Feeling would be nice game. <coughs> no, nope. just an invisible wall. And corpses. Damn, there are a lot of invisible walls in here. The hell is this? Why the hell is this? Oh, 
I'm getting attacked now. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh. Charles, why did the boss take the real beta connectors out of commission? Were they defective? Not entirely. Dr. Sechenov wasn't convinced that there was any need for discretionary authority within Collective. So the boss wanted total equality, but Molotov's schemes changed his mind? Perhaps so, Comrade Major. What do you mean, perhaps? Dr. Sechenov wanted equality for everyone. There can be no question of that. But consider this. The Alpha Connector existed from the very beginning. Maybe the boss wasn't planning to use the Alpha Connector's power. He just needed it to launch Collective. That's possible, right? Anything is possible. Here's your leg, do yourself a pair thing. <laughs> cool tech. Hey, we got two legs already. I'm safe. Uh, I need to go upstairs. Upstairs. Why is that thing breathing? Pulsating? Okay, through here. I need to get to the vendor. God, they're gonna be bucks. New scanning cycle. Module, limb, arm, right. Found. Location, Vavilov floor. Transmission obstructed. Data incomplete. <sighs> What's the holdup? Why can't we locate the module this time? I'm afraid I can't help you. There's some kind of interference on this floor. Possible sources of interference include electromagnetic shielding oh or the presence of a large, elongated object. A large, elongated object? That sounds odd. Oh, not the same problem again. Oh my god. Time for the next puzzle, I mean. Oh fuck. Oh, okay. Let's heal. This bad boy. The hell are those things actually? Energy, energy, vodka. Nothing else with me. Oh, fire. One shot. Wow, there's a big honking thing in here, and lots of little fuckers. system it just sometimes comes up until it stops immediately during the fight still i don't need to worry about that one dude here
<laughs> what? The hell? <laughs> oh, I'm tired. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna go to music. Why? <gasps> oh. What am I supposed to do with this? Okay, let's press just the button. <laughs> what is this, a kid's game? That is a puzzle key. Nice. What's it for? I believe it activates some sort of process. Okay. This game just has too many puzzles. I don't want to play this. I don't want to play it. I don't even know what to press. Like seriously, I don't know what to press, man. Is there an auto skip button? <laughs> it's fucking puzzle system. I can't take all the goddamn puzzles they throw at me. Like, seriously. get it I don't get it get it ah it's just some info here Think about it. I don't. I don't. I think it's half a day. <gasps> okay, I'm done. <gasps> Fuck this. Oh, fuck this game. Yeah, no, I mean, yeah, get me out of here. I don't care, I don't care, I'm done. <laughs> oh, I'm done. Yeah, maybe I'm just gonna bury this game. <laughs> deep, deep, I don't know. I don't know, man. I can't do all this process. It's just too much. <laughs>